<laughs> Negotiations. Zero goes for DM2. Okay! DM2. Yay! Let's meet up in the sauna. And of course, countdown gets started only to be broken off. But nothing of the sort happened in the previous game, actually. That was good. I like that. <laughs> Work over because he's not reconnected to the server. Uh, last scores is the Finns lost the final map. It, it, they looked like they were going to get it, and then Billy and someone turned it around nicely. Whereas here, it's a different game, so I don't have last scores. The only last scores I can tell you about is that uh, Conan and Mutilator have been playing some DM4 warm-up, and then some more of that, and then again. So we'll have some, I, I expect, some DM4, but I might be mistaken. But we go with DM2. 4 HP. The smooth jowls can kind of gives a Twin Peaks vibe. I, I, I just hope it's damn good coffee. Conan is in jail. Actually, no, Holo is in jail. First squad to Hembrent. Secret. Shoot the button. There you go. We don't make mistakes, we only have happy accidents. They both have some red. Oh, sneaky, I saw, I saw some red. Yeah, Mutilator was in the path. The red armor is gone, still has some mega, he's dead. He's dead. Zero hunted him down. Well done. Holo will not have free reign over the quad. Nice surprise attack. And Mewtwo saves the day, so I want to see him do a quad run. I've heard the rumors that this guy used to be really, really good. I mean, of course he was. He was in one, in the uh, classic Frag Highlight movie, Fragstone Extreme. Three and possibly two and one before that as well. Teams are tied. Oof, the rockets from Mutilator. And we're going to see what he does. I'm going to remove Auto Track and we'll get to follow him around a little bit as he hopefully gets some health. Not gonna challenge for quad just yet. No, Hollow is gonna have it, so let's see as Muti waits for Hollow to push through big. And that didn't work out. I'm actually gonna switch to Hollow. Oh no, he got killed. So back to Mutilator it is then. That quad, that whole quad damage situation sorted itself. No, no worries. All good. Plus four. Still doing pretty good with that uh, good bit of mega health. Oh yeah, there we go. Ambushed. He was doing the ambush, considering the position, and then two enemies. What the hell is that? Respect, respect the Paco, man. That was a nice defensive pine from zero. Easy, and let's go take a look at the squad. Hollow has it. He also has the secret red. Anyone around this? Of course, 
very visible with the light. Mutilator's gonna have high rocket. I mean, ooh, okay. Sneaky play from Conan was that? Because Mutilator stayed right right where he is right now, and that quad double peaked, double peaked the corner. But then there was a Conan. A wild Conan appeared. And we are still tied, pretty much. Very even. 11-9. 11-9. Oof, okay. Pine finds its target. Quad is up. Quad goes to Mutilator for free. Holo will not escape. Possibly not of zero either. Yellow's gone. Zero's gone. Easy, so someone's at secret. We saw him. Holo got that red. No problems from UT leader. Conan was looking over the water room. Actually, he still is. Um, the other Swedes are full. Okay, so it's red armors are plenty. Better hit your rockets now. TSQ are pulling ahead. I don't even know what TSQ stands for. I have to find something because they're all Swedes. I can't just say, oh, the Swedes just got a frag and then, but then the other Swedes did. That doesn't work. Zero with the quad. Fourth quad for the booze makers. Watch out, there's your friend! No, no, that's not your friend, sorry. But they seem so friendly in pre-war. Suicide quad. Just two frags ahead. The suicide quad, right. Makes sense. Thank you. I'll double check, but you are probably right. What the fuck? Yeah, the Suicide Quad. Conan, Jevil, Skelguapo, Mutilator, Nas, Zero. Founded in 2022. With former members of Oblivion, Lady Artists, Tribe of Chernobyl, Chosen in Hellfire. All right, all right. Mutilator with the Quad. Not finding any targets. Where are these guys? Do I have. Yes, we have a radar on this. They're on the other side, they're in big room. I haven't redrawn this. <laughs> Maybe one day. Still close. Still close. Actually, <laughs> yeah, the teammates are watching. El Guapo is one of theirs, one of the TSQs. Sorry, that guy got the secret red. Ah, okay, Zero S is able to get a quad for free. Even gets the yellow for his trouble. Doesn't care about the backpack. Nice. Against the uh, the pillar. Ah! Shouldn't have missed the first one. And we're tied. That's a little insulting. Imagine your teammate asking you, Stat status, piece of shit, status, piece of shit. I wouldn't want to be called piece of shit by my teammate all the time. Oh, I'm being told it means position, right? Or point of sale, but anyone who's been in a store will probably say that a point of sale is typically a piece of shit. Often a piece of shit. Team Red, Suicide Quakers, Suicide Quads. Kundo Quake Club is another team. And that's Finns in there. 
a sticky and kip. The blue Swedes are ahead. What? Da, 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 da. Close quarters fighting Conan. Well done. That's a quad taken care of, and then another guy who thought he was a quad too. Kick ass. Chihiski win the lead now. That's that's crazy. It just keeps going back and forth by a handful of frags. Please turn on my battery saver. Yes. Thank you for the notice. My scene switcher runs Android and has just helpfully informed me that it's about to run out of batteries. In a couple hours, that is. Conan with the quad again, got it for free. And they're plus 16 now, so that should be it. Come on. That's your friend. That's your friend. Yeah, exactly. Close until the last minute. And not a boring type of close DM2. Actually, that was interesting. So I'm glad we saw it play out that way. So, that's a win for boom yeah tsq i remembered correctly i keep forgetting these things i have a very very short working memory du, 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 du. blood run it is uh that was picked by ham brent that's picked by these guys and they go for blood run Blood run. Thank you. MVP, mutilator. Okay. Get ready for the great spawns of Blood Run. There we go. TSQ first squad, dead. It's dead. First head for the blues. It's gone. And we're tied. Conan looks like he could challenge for this. Nah. Yeah? Nah. Red goes to zero. And the blues meet at yellow. That could be confusing if you don't see what... What, 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 what are you talking about? What are all these colors? Zero is kind of stacked. They're in a good position for this. Oh, let himself be tickled a little, but that's fine. Actually, first rocket by Conan, kind of helpful. Pulled Zero in a little. There we go, some frags. Team Blue is pulling ahead. And he had some good trigger discipline, not shooting towards the uh, rocket launcher there, because that was his friend. Just about makes it alive. Escapes by the skin of his teeth. Throwing frags ahead. That's a start. Mutilator, not a frag to his name yet. Actually, he has one and then he lost it. Team Blue with a quad. Little miss mishap by Team Blue, both jumping for red. 
nearly team killing his friend as well here. But look behind you, there's an enemy on the other end of that corridor. Oops. <laughs> Gotta be careful. 17, 18. Okay, so we have... Team Blue is about to double their frag advantage. He will get the red after all. <laughs> Lucky respawn. There is no health around here for him anymore. Zero was kind of lonely at this squad. Risky. Derp. Steals the red. Baits the other guy into following him, exposing him to a quad lurking down below. Team Blue is a few frags ahead, but TSQ looking good. They need to keep on picking up these reds. This is just the third one by now. Quads would be good too, but I mean anything, you know, would be good. Yes, I have graduated from the University of Captain Obvious. Red coming up, Conan is healthy enough for this. Yes, send the weaker guy first. And now not the weaker guy anymore. He's got he's got the red. Plus eight, so that lead has been sort of fixed by TSQ, but uh, Conan is not done with his quadrant yet. And you can imagine the ice cream sound playing. I just can't play it with the button right now. I have to click in OBS. I don't want to do that. Teams are tied. Well done. That quadrant was key for them. Let's reset things a little bit. Actually, not just a reset. It's to their advantage now. We are halfway through this second map. Quad is up, close to zero. Fourth quad for his team. Red will go to his teamy. He's a little, oh, he's a little dead. <laughs> he's a little early for yellow. Did Mute Leader have any armor there? I mean, I, I know he just picked up yellow, but secure the area without any on his back. Saving that yellow for later. Well, if all games in the series are closed like this, that's gonna be good. Quad coming up. Some health would be really nice. Okay, Conan pushes through into the L junction. Oh, the pine! Yeah. Okay. Mega coming up. Conan looks like he's maybe waiting for it. And he won't get it. Mega has gone to hollow. with a sliver of yellow on him yet. Ah, there we go. Team's right side. Teams are tied and all of these armors are gone. Yellow gonna be up, red is up. Zero clearly not Lord Liming the jump across. And that red is all, has all, well, no, it, it, it served its, pur its purpose. Allowed him to survive into picking up plastic armor and quad. 
And now that they have caught a few frags ahead, what are you gonna do? Th that red is a nice bait, potentially. Red is used as bait. Oof, well that was a little clumsy. Not quite sure what happened. Oh, nice shots. Zero and Mutilator trade. Team Blue is a handful of frags ahead. More trades. Rez probably going to go to Mutilator. Yeah, there we go. No one's coming back. Well, no one's respawning at his face. She can back at it. Plus four. 808 has gone by. Watch out for 909. Watch out for quad mostly. Again. This is still neck for neck. Conan has red. Mutilator has red. Team Blue has nothing. And they'll probably miss out on the next red. Careful, it's coming up now. Both TSQs on one side of the map. None of them is up. They could get backstabbed. They won't be getting backstabbed. They will take plus 10 frags and the red. With final minutes about to enter. We're about to enter the final minute. Yeah, that's the way it goes. So TSQ sitting pretty. <laughs> they could take this now. And... 909. There we go. What kind of numbers are we getting? Six direct rockets. Oh. Maybe they have heard our cries for overtime. I don't know whose cries those were, but there must have been some. Because it's slowing down now. 13 frags. I'm not seeing too many... Uh, there's not too much going on in the kill... Kill feed upright. Yeah, now it's happening. But TSQ are going to take this. Fiend your butt. Yeah, and I will get to pick the next map. What the hell? Conan with 9,000 damage. That's a lot of quads. And remember, Conan, nothing hurts him. Only pain. Parap squad one. What? One quad? Just one quad? Yeah. Conan just got one quad and still dealt 9,000 damage. <laughs> what? Ah, DM4. Okay. DM4. Three, two, one. Cancel the countdown and go. Watch out for the pines. Surprise butt sex on Conan. Team Hembrent getting some homeboy support in the chat. Yeah, they're 2-0 down. They need your support. To be fair, it's 2-0 down, but those were close games. We'll review last scores later on, but close games. Hmm. Ah, yeah, there you go. One doesn't simply go across low mid on the M4. That's not how this works. TSQ starting to create a little lead for themselves. Right, one on each level. And that's, that's... Positioning is working out. Can I really settle into it? You never really can on the M4, can you? 
eventually someone's going to respawn on the red armor and do something with it. Eventually. Nine frag diff. What's happening? Mutant Conan doing their thing? I hear a lot of crackling from those lightning guns. Might have to look at the numbers continuously. Right, so he wears out his armor over a long period of time. At a range. Uh, maybe not at a range. That was a nade in his face. Ten frags. Little lick of LG. Cute. Moose Leader's been able to cross to the armor's room. He's at red. Conan has a red. There he is. Yeah, three reading spots. Brick coming up, and of course someone's gonna spawn on it. Maybe. 3, 2, 1. Don't die. Okay, he got it. That's fine. Thanks for the lightning gun. And now don't have to drop into the pit to get a good weapon. Well, to get a, that other useful weapon. 14 frags ahead. Right, two shafts. Denied. That was close. The enemy almost got a red. So we have a bit of a problem for Team Blue because TSQ are doing better at mid, it seems. But are also, they are doing that while also getting more of the uh, useful armors. As we just saw now. So we've seen time and time again people winning without having as many armors as the other guys. On positioning and that kind of stuff. But if they can, if they can do both, this could go really, really wrong. It's not that bad, it's not to the tune of a Miltoning, which when you receive a Miltoning on this map, on any map, you get plus 10 frag difference per minute imposed to you. So it would be plus 40 for TSQ right now. Actually, between plus 40 and plus 60, because there's a bit of variation in speed. more red armors, that's good. I think blue have not picked up a single red armor in a couple of minutes now. We saw that one of them nearly had one and got denied mere quick units away from the item. Ah, there we go, fifth red. And zero pauses for a split second to celebrate the achievement of picking up Another red armor on this map against these guys. No health. Conan almost could have had him there. Uh, 
Hollow gets claimed by the gods of lava. He will not be getting a discharge frag. Not gonna happen this time. Maybe later, but not now. Eleven. Mewtwo defends this. Conan is on top as well. Gets traded actually. Conan and Hollow trade. Someone is gonna have to take Mewtwo's spot at mid. Oh, so Holo just bored on someone respawning in his face. That was that was pretty. Only in Quake World. Still not a big frag difference, but it's remained pretty steady overall. I'm going to take something extra from Team Blue to uh, break this. Red is up. Good pine from zero. He also did Conan as well. Good comeback weapon. Sixteen reds. Finish him. Oh, could have had a rocket back. The enemy could have had a rocket and then turn that around, but no, 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 no. Not with your teammate going through the teleport at the same time. 22. Okay. Things getting a little more comfortable for TSQ. The sexy Quakers now in the final minute of this game with a good lead. That gets least and least likely to be overturned by the second. Holo suffering a little more here on efficiency. He's died the most frag the least. seconds to go. It's now impossible to have a comeback. And TSQ will get to pick the final map and I'm hoping they don't go for DM6. And that's another W for TSQ. One more map, gentlemen. 50, almost 58% efficiency from UT. 10 kills. DM6, no! No! Why? Why? Of course it was going to be this. Well, at least it's the final map of the evening for me. So I got that going for me, which is nice. Three, two, one, who spawns on red? Hollow gets it. Oh, they remembered to enable ring. Nice. Hollow has the ring, he got the first red and he's got the ring, so that's a bit of a thorn in TSQ's side. TSQ now have to regroup, pick up some yellows, megas, hopefully get an LG. And actually that was an LG given away to them. Zero has had the second red.
push one out, and another one comes in. Mega is up. And a little bit teleport dancing later, it goes to the red team. Nice. Red armor goes to TSQ. That was a nice synchronized push from them. Yeah, we should apply for the uh, appearance of Quake at the Olympics. Uh, the uh, actual... The actual thing being played at the Quake Olympics would be a synchronized red armor push. Ooh, looks like someone's waiting for... Ooh. Shame on you, dirty boy. Red's coming up. Hembrandt, a few frags ahead. 15 frags ahead on the M6. Not a problem yet. But more of a problem than on other maps, potentially. TSQ are doing the mega health and green armor thing. Nice rocket from Conan. That was a headshot on, on zero, I think. Did some good damage. Twenty plus frag lead for Team Blue. Looking good. Still doing the reds. TSQ have had only one of that. Hello, juggling with ease. Even in death. That's a bit messy. Conan, zero, zero. Mm. Okay, and that's fine, that's fine. Zero gets the red again. Let's stick to him for a bit. Oof, ran straight into Mewtwo's rocket. 25 frag difference. Let's see what the red armor guy has to say about this. Thankfully, Holo missed a rocket. That was his downfall. Mewtwo secures red. He's got enough ammunition to spam for a bit. It's not crazy high amounts of rockets, but it, it's good. Nice! Forced the enemy into a team kill. That's really nice. I like that. Style points. Plus 20, so it's a bit less, that frag difference, but... At about halfway through, it's starting to become a little comfortable. They cannot rest on their laurels, though, as HP had red control for a while and could do what they might have what it takes to uh, orchestrate a retake of this red armor. So watch out. Bouncy, bouncy, not finding the target, but... <laughs> That's kind of silly. So we have two red armors. We had two red armors on the red team side. It's just Conan now, but that's fine. Muti has picked up the ring, which he uses to reclaim red with. And Team Blue is now in trouble as that lead has almost completely disappeared now. TS TSQ have red armors, both of them. Next one is up, it'll go to Conan unless one of the HPs respawn on it, but they won't. Muti has red and Mega and he's just gonna sit by that teleport. 
eventually the Hembrand guys will want to go get the mega health because that's what they need for their comeback. For their comeback, they need this mega, they need a shaft, they need a green. TSQ have taken the lead now. Nice shots! <laughs> sniped with rockets. Oh, we got sniped with rockets from underneath. Headshots too. Teams are tied. 3.30 to go. Zero ventures out of his red armor porch. So we have an easy red armor guy. There you go. Taken care of. Nice repositioning from Holo through the Tully. Wrapped around Mutilator. Go back to the track. Let's see who gets picked next by the camera. TSQ lead by hardly anything. Team Blue attacks desynced. They will die. Each of them will die in turn. Under three minutes to go. Red armor likely going to zero. So they're trading spots. They've been able to trade spots at red armor a few times now. So, again, a close map with some good back and forth. Not a completely dominant side on the M6. Always boring when that happens. Let's just camp on red for the whole game. And hopefully the other guys won't be synced up enough and equipped enough to make any dents in our big stacks. Oh, that tasty box of rockets. There aren't that many here. Make sure you enjoy it. Pick up that thing. More rockets. And he's not missing too much. Embrent in the lead. One and a half minutes to go. This is the shot I winning one map in the series. So they can go to bed with a smile on their face. Arguably, even if they don't win the map, they can still go to bed with a smile on their face. It, it has been a close series on all four maps. Good back and forth. Proper challenge. Final minute coming soon. No more ring for anyone. It's just, it's just the two ones. One at zero, one at five. That's it. Some people have been making a case for um, ring respawn time of three minutes on this map. But that's not gone anywhere. Mid guys in his QC, that was this QC winning 4-0. Uh, 3-2-1, sorry. It, they could have had 4-0, but... Final few seconds. And this is going the right way for Team Red. Embrandt do not have any red armor. They have rockets, they need to be coordinated. And it's not gonna happen. It, can it happen? No! Zero jumps into that rocket and that will be the end of that. Right, final push comes in. And that is the end of that game. Actually, that's not hardcore enough. That's better. So that's another W for TSQ. 4-0 for TSQ. Ouch. Well fought. So watch out, it's split in two. I don't know why, but it's split in two. Pretty good series.
and looking forward to seeing more of these guys in their further matches. So you're at predicted 2-2. Two to two. And really, you're not too far off. <laughs> it says 4-0, but close. It was close. It was close, so good, good, good stuff, good stuff. Right. Durr. That's a little too intense. Right, so I'm done with games for tonight.